we set one nursery up and first week we had one child on one day. Very, very slow um, and we couldn't understand why. It never ever turned a profit. Set this second nursery up and managed to afford the community to play furniture. I think they opened on the first day with 19 children. Shortly afterwards it was full and we've been having a waiting list ever since. So you know, we're convinced that it's the furniture and the look of the building that is the reason we've got a full nursery. With the old furniture we had a few problems, maybe it wasn't the right height, we didn't have chairs that fitted under correctly, it wasn't a versatile to move it around. Setting up of this nursery, I was like a child myself, I couldn't wait to get your catalogue, look through the catalogue and choose what I wanted and I wanted the children to be as sighted as I was with the furniture. Since we've had the furniture we have noticed here compared to our other settings, it normally is a more calmer children are happier, they've got easy access, so with no trapping worries. The products are just user-friendly, child-friendly. For children, they have a sense that this is their environment, a sense of ownership. You know, nothing's hidden away. You know, the drawers are all clear, and the children aren't pulling at them looking for things. It's there to see. Everything's child height. The tables are fantastic, how you can put so many different height settings on them. It's just really putting the children's needs at the forefront of what we do. It's accommodating them at every level. Within our setting, we have our babies, our toddlers in our preschool, and having the community play furniture that enables us to create different uh, environments within the one room. So we've got a Pacific baby area, which works really well. We at first didn't have as many babies and it changes from year to year so we can use the furniture to manipulate the space to uh, adapt to our current numbers within our cohort. I like that we can bring the outside in with the furniture and you know when the light of the sun bounces on it it lifts the room. When we do a show round and the parents walk through the door their instant reaction is wow we don't need to really sell the nursery. They always say oh it's such a home from home environment and the children are going to love here and they really appreciate that. People look and they see quality they assume that's inbreded which hopefully it is throughout the setting, as they come through the door, our job's done. They visualise their children in your nursery, so they've already made up their mind within the first few seconds of, of what they've seen in the environment. It's very rare somebody comes and doesn't sign up to come. So when I first looked, I thought the price was unbelievably expensive. I wouldn't have dreamt of buying it because I couldn't justify in my own head the cost but if, like I say, if you split the cost over 15 years, you've got 15 years of warranty on that furniture. They just pay for themselves by the community to play products because even if you can't really afford them, stretch yourself because they're going to save you money in the long term and they will make your nursery be full like ours are.